welcome everyone back to the second episode of Rand of Kings. Today we are back on the server exactly where we left off. Uh, we gotta collect this clay we never ended up getting last episode. See, this is where we spawned before, and uh, I don't I don't know exactly what happened. This is exactly where this is exactly where it was, but it wasn't there like when we spawned. It was so weird. Like it wasn't there the first time when we came back. I'm pretty sure, unless I was like losing my mind. But uh, I'm gonna collect this. Actually, hit back to you because I know this is just not that fun and not that uh, entertaining for some people. So I'm gonna collect all this clay and probably end up getting back to you guys and then we'll go on our journey for what we're gonna do today in the episode. All right, and we're back. We got all that clay right there. We got a little flax as well. We're gonna make a stone ax so we can craft all the, or uh, chop down these trees a lot easier. Cause it takes a while to use my club and it's kind of really pointless to just waste the time when we have enough flax to do it. Also, I made a spear um, in that little cut jump right there because I also learned, I try to attack in my first ever like attempt in this, when I first tried to record on the public server, I tried to attack a deer, and uh, it was just a long process, and they ended up disappearing. So what I learned actually was I am uh, supposed to hunt it down with a spear. Actually, I'm not exactly. I don't know why I said actually so much, and that that was kind of annoying to me, but uh, I can't imagine for you guys. But uh, I'm not exactly sure if I can throw multiple, if it goes with multiple or not, but. Uh, uh, I, I saw someone and when they were sh or when they were attacking the deer they used like five or six spears it, or it took like six or seven to actually kill it So I'm not quite sure if that means I have to make six or seven of them Or if I can automatically just throw a bunch at a time and that's like a, a stack of spears actually Because it, it takes about a hundred pieces of wood and there's no way a hundred hundred pieces of wood equals up one spear Which is kind of crazy. All right, we're gonna chop this down though, and then we're probably gonna find a base uh, just a base like station for where we're gonna stay and uh, That's basically me it we're gonna make a uh, some equipment some uh, just you know You just typical materials I guess as you could say we got a lot of wood now though So we're gonna work our way into the fields over here uh, I think we got enough stone got enough materials for everything for now and you see the bottom right though our bodies getting low I'm not quite sure what that is and it looks like the clay spawned back again. I'm not maybe clay spawns That's weird because I'm pretty sure that wasn't there just a few seconds ago, or we already got that as well earlier. We're not going to get it again. I think I think we got enough clay, but unfortunately, as you guys can see, it uh, seems like our health or something, something's getting low on the bottom right. I'm not quite sure what the, uh, the player indicates, but it wasn't yellow or orange all the time. So we're probably going to have to do something, probably uh, find some berries or something like that. I'll, I'll end up collecting like you see right there. I'll collect materials on the way I'm not gonna go out of my way though to find but if I find like some flax or if I find stone I'm definitely gonna grab some because I, I think as much as much as possible is like the best like as much we can get I, I Mean we have a crazy big inventory for not carrying like a backpack or any kind of container holding thing I, I just, You know, it just a, there's a lot of space in here that we can actually carry there's four rows of what what is that? Is that eight? Four rows of eight that we can carry materials in. Oh, I'm getting attacked by something. Am I? Oh, dude, no. My dude... My dude's losing his sanity. That's what's happening. I think my dude's going crazy. I'm not quite sure how it's working. But he's definitely losing his mind. But anyway, like I was saying, there is a lot, a lot of... Uh, just... just crazy like amounts of material that uh, we don't need where in the world do I go do I go this way like, I know there's an island but it ends right there that's crazy I don't know if it's a private server for the fact that uh, it's a smaller island and there is no kingdom that would be dumb because that would just be a waste of the series that we just did but usually it's a lot bigger than this hopefully on the way we find some berries so we can regenerate our guy though because this dude's this dude's dying over here this dude is not doing well. Did I end up being dumb and making a... Did I get on a private server that's not like the normal... The normal land? I think I did that, though. I'm so butthurt if I did. Because I, I don't see, like, anything. Usually there's a kingdom. And there's, there's always a castle that the king's on. And it's always, like, pre-made with the servers that you get on. Or at least the public ones. I, this is, like, the first ever when I've tried to join, I probably should have tried to try to join multiple. That probably would have been good just to see. Actually, no, I, I think it is. I think the island just continues off over here and we just got on like the, the bad end of it for the start. Uh, but it seems to be like on that side, it gets 
quite larger. And maybe, is that the castle over there? I, I just know that it's there somewhere, so. Can't be too complain. I'm, I think I'm gonna die soon, so I should probably make that bed here. Cause our dude, our dude is dying over here. He's something's fucking, something's happening to him, and I don't, I don't know what it is, but he's getting red. He started going crazy. We're gonna place his bed down. I'm not quite sure if there's like a certain spot I gotta make it. All right, here's our bag. Here, here's where we died, boys. We gotta get all our stuff. Uh, we had a lot of stuff on us. Is there like a? Is there, yeah, there's. An, you just gotta spam click. Oh my god, look how much clay we have. 873. Yeah, we're never running out. Let's put a spear back in my inventory, though, so we can attack animals. Uh, and we're gonna work our way back to where we spawn. Uh, I didn't know that you can spawn, like, anywhere on the beach. I thought it was, like, one general area, which is kind of a good thing, though, because I guess if you end up in, like, private servers, then people will spawn kill the shit out of you. Like I said, though, I think the kill, or the kingdom is over here, so I'm gonna climb these rocky mountains, get over, see what's happening. And hopefully we find some berries and uh, some just some animals to kill on the way. Which is also unfortunate, though, is the king can take tax out of the meat. If actually the king sees you killing any animals or any of the deer, he can actually kill you as well. Which is pretty crazy to think about. Just because it's called... I'm not quite sure what their names are or like what the name of the deer is. But it, it, I know it just the land is the king's. I guess the king's land. So he has the right to kill you if... Uh, you end up killing a steer. This game also has some pretty dope background music. It only have it only shows or uh, it only comes on like every once in a while. It's really weird. Uh, unfortunately, it's not like a consistent background noise, which I guess could be good in the sense of you know all these let's plays that are, or like people doing let's plays. Okay, so here's here's some berries. I think we we found some berries, so we're good on that. So we're not like too worried about dying or. Uh, uh, I, I know that you need a lot of berries to even fill up your hunger bar, so we're definitely going to need to hunt down some animals. And uh, that'll definitely be do some, something we do. Hopefully, though, we find a field of uh, flax or something that we can, we can go through. Is that a house that I see, or is that a stone? No, this would be our first encounter with someone else if that's a house. No, that's, that's just a stone rock. All right, here we got, we got fields of hay. So, like I said, there are fields of uh, flax, there's fields of clay, there's fields of iron, which are pretty neat. We're going to work our way up here, though, because I think this is where, what? That looks like uh, where the king might be, up top of this. And this is tends to be where everyone's located in the entire population. There, Like I said, there is only four people on the server right now, which is kind of good. I didn't want to find a server that was, like, too big where there's so many people in it that I couldn't bear. And there's just a lot of idiots just trying to kill you constantly. But uh, at least we got some more flack. Yeah, that's definitely, that's the king right there. Uh, we'll get close to it so people who haven't seen this game before will can, can see what it looks like and see what the actual kingdom is that we're going to have to overrun soon. Uh, and then, then we'll start uh, breaking down some trees, building a house. Or, you know, just building a little fort that we can make. But these are, these are the fields of flax I was talking about. They're open fields. There should be deer in here somewhere. And hopefully we encounter someone that we can just interact with and see what, what they're up to. And hopefully, you can get a small look on that. I'm not sure exactly my render distance isn't too, uh, too high. So you can't really... I'll get closer to it so you can see. I'm not quite sure if it's my render distance or if the game in general. Because I, I see a lot of people playing this. And the glare on it is, seems to be the same for everyone. Oh, we're going to pick these pick these flowers. Make ourselves look pretty. I'm not sure what that is. Cabbage. I think we can eat cabbage too, so we're pretty we're pretty good on that. All right, there is uh, the tower right there. We'll get closer so we can uh, even get a better look. It seems pretty like see through at the moment because we're not close enough. But uh, yeah, that, that's basically what we're trying to overrun. This is the backside of it, I'm pretty sure. But we get close enough. There's King's Guard that'll kill us, and uh, that won't end well. So we're we're just hunting. We're just looking for uh, food, and hopefully no one comes down and just tries to murk us or anything but that is eventually we're trying to work our way up to to overrun and uh take over and it'll be ours as we see there's a little house over there maybe we can uh we can find someone but at the same time i don't really want them to kill us Ooh, is this some carrots yeah see more food for us that'd be good right here nine carrots so we're see we're pretty good see all we need to do last episode was just look for uh look for fields and uh just look for uh just, you know more uh agriculture than there was before we were just stuck on the beach and we weren't really doing anything but now that we're in the open fields there's a lot of flowers there's a lot of food so we're not i'm not too worried about dying because now that uh 
Now that we have all the cabbage, carrots, and all that kind of stuff, I, I think we're pretty set. So next, like, next goal right now would be to make a house. And that'd, that'd be pretty much it. I'm gonna collect all this flax, because, uh, I don't know, I just have this, uh, addiction to it towards, or addiction towards it, kind of, because uh, last, time, or last time I tried this, I couldn't find any in the entire time. I was just running around hunting for flax. And now that I see fields of it, it's just, it's just amazing to me. And I'm just obsessed with it and obsessed with grabbing flax, which is kind of, kind of weird. I don't know why, but anyway, it seems I will, seeing that's a role play server, I'm not too worried about, uh, people taking over my house. So I'm kind of, kind of into just starting a house right here, maybe, but at the same time, it'd be so cool to start on the top of that hill. I know last episode I said I was going to work on it and, uh, just work on, uh, making the house now or, uh, making the house this episode, you know, but at the same time, I'm, I still have been getting materials. I, I think I might start it over here. I mean, we can obviously move it eventually, maybe up to the top of the mountain and it, it'd be, it'd be pretty difficult to, uh, take it down at the same time. I don't know if the King would get mad if I just make it in the middle of his open field. At the same time, he might like it because I'm just, you know, opening it up to more things. And it just make it look better. I mean, I don't think he would get too mad because that dude over there has a house right, like, closer than I would next to it. So we're going to tear down this rock, start building. Like I promised you guys, I said I was going to build a house today. Or at least start the foundation. I'll probably end up building, like, a chest, a workstation, all that. Just to, just to start out. And see how that ends up going. Hopefully this uh, series does pretty well. I'm not expecting to get a lot of people to watch it. Just like the, the couple of people that I, um, are actually interested in watching uh, my videos. Or in regards to this. Because a lot of people just watch it for the funny moments. So uh, this is just for the few people that will enjoy it. You know, I don't really care how it does. I mean, at the same time, I would love if it did well. Maybe catch new viewers. I think new viewers, there's a lot of... There's a small community around this game. It used to be pretty big because it's still in like a a beta form i'm pretty sure it's still just it hasn't the full game is not out yet it's not fully out i don't know if they're still developing it or anything because it kind of died down but this game used to be pretty popular about a month or two ago and uh there's not that many uh people out there but there is a lot of uh small servers i saw when i was looking for this server there's a, there's a small small group of people that uh still play it or at least but let's get a get an idea of uh did we need to make a bucket we didn't uh is that a war drum being higher resolution, what is this for? I think maybe that it's just a drum, I guess. I thought I thought that was for like uh, you know just building. But uh, thatch block, low quality material. No, we don't want hay. We don't want a hay block. We want. Do we want a clay block? I mean, I guess we can make it out of clay. Let's see what it looks like though, because I would love to make it out of wood. But at the same time, I haven't seen wood here, and I, I think I need a workbench for that. I'm pretty sure. I'll probably end up needing a workbench. All right, is there a way I can place this? Can I not place it on this field? I'm not quite sure how that works. Yeah, maybe, I, maybe I'm not allowed to. See, I'm not quite sure how that works. Okay, so I can place it there. Wait, why can't I place it before? Cannot build in this area. Okay, so that's pretty unfortunate. Oh, so it is the king's area. We're gonna have to move. We're gonna move on top of that, 100% uh, on top of the mountain though. Hopefully that is a good area, like, uh, there's not too many problems, or, uh, different elevation. I shouldn't, it should be a problem, we're gonna work our way up there, and, uh, definitely build. As you see, there is more, uh, oh my god, that looks so dope. I don't know if someone built that, or if that's like a, uh, just a normal spawn thing, there's no way. That looks so awesome. I don't know if that's just automatically there, I've never seen something like that before in this game. That looks so cool, it's all smoky and stuff. We definitely want to make a big impact, though. I want to. I want to be a big role in this, uh, this world, and hopefully get to know these people. There is a Discord, like they said. That looks so cool in there. I'm not gonna go in there just in case of dying. I don't really want to die. Uh, that looks awesome. Here, we're we're gonna walk around holding that clay block. To see, see, we can place it here. So I guess, do we want to build on top of that mountain, or we? I don't really want to build it across from that guy. So at the same time, uh. I just want to let him do his thing. Okay, is this a duck? Oh my god. This is our time. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Okay, that duck is about to let us kill him. That's about to, I don't know why I'm freaking out because it's a duck. Can we not kill the duck? Can we not kill the duck? How do I throw this? I'm not dude, I'm I'm really new at this. I really I don't know how to throw this. I, I'm really not good at this, huh? Okay, so I just hit him. Dude, let me kill the duck! Oh my god, I killed him. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, so now we get a meat cleaver. We're gonna start pounding on this duck. Oh yeah, we gotta get a meat from it. This is really brutal. This is the first time I killed, though. I'm pretty proud of myself. I've like, uh, never killed. Now, next, we gotta kill that deer that I was telling you guys about. There are a few around here. Hopefully no one sees me doing this, because I'll definitely get murked. The king's gonna murder my face. If he finds me just killing ducks out here, boy. I'm not a brutal guy, alright? This is getting really bloody. This is really gory right now. Come on. Can I get everything from him? He should disappear. There's no way it takes this many hits to get all the materials from a duck. I'm just trying to get everything I can. Okay, there we go. Everything's gone. Alright, we're good. Maybe we can build it in this little, uh... Ooh, there's actually a lot of ducks over here. So we're not doing too bad, actually. Yeah, let's build it. Let's build it here. Because we can get... This would be a good fishing hole. Hopefully we... Here, actually, let's try to collect some water right here. This would be a good fishing hole, I know. Yeah, see, here we go. We'll, uh... We'll collect some water here. Uh... Alright. Do I need a bucket? Oh, no, we're good. Alright, I know it glitches every once in a while, though. All right, so we're gonna get like 25, maybe. Actually, no, it's going up by three. We'll get we'll get about like 30 or 40 things of water, and uh, you know, just work. And then start building a house. That's that's the main idea. I'll at least build the foundation of the house for this episode because it's getting kind of long. But uh, uh, yeah, I'm not too worried about the water, so we'll we'll, we'll stop right now. We'll stop on the whole uh, water thing because uh, I'm not too worried seeing that we're you know living right next to it. But we're gonna get the block now and uh see if we can make this i don't know how it's gonna work if we're gonna build like can i not build there oh i guess it was just one up i don't know how it's gonna work maybe we can uh here, here how many how many are we gonna build here let's build let's build about 50 40 sec all right it's gonna take 50 seconds it's not too bad i mean i'm not i'm not complaining can i not uh it's still going it's still going uh we might eventually, like, upgrade and make it cobble, or at least stone, I mean. I'm not quite sure how to do that. I think we're going to have to make a workbench, and uh, eventually we're going to make armor, we're going to make all these tools, learn how to do stuff. See, we needed the wooden javelin. That's probably what we needed uh, to throw at those, uh, just to throw at the duck and throw at the deer and all that. But hopefully, can I, hopefully while it's crafting, I can place it at the same time. I mean, that'd, that'd be pretty cheap. Okay, it actually lets me, which is not that bad. I didn't I didn't expect it to let me do that at all, really. Uh, I mean, it would make sense if it didn't. I don't like this little angle, how, how it's doing right here. I don't, I don't like the angle it's at, but I mean, I can't really complain at the same time. Come on, duck. You're gonna have to move, guy. Thanks. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna complain about it, but uh, eventually we're probably gonna move this house because the, the angle is that I don't like it. I would rather... Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Please. Please stop. Give me that. Okay. No, don't. Okay. I'm not good at this, alright? I'm really not good at this. We're gonna make a small little hut, though. I don't like the placement of this. It, I mean... Stop doing that! Why can't you place on the ground like a normal person? Come on. Place on the ground. Okay. Did I just did I just build one under? There's no way I just build one in the ground like that. Why is it so difficult? Maybe I'm just dumb, but it's so difficult to build a foundation. We're gonna build a small little what four by four or something like that or whatever this is. Four by five. We'll build a five by five, I guess. So we'll build one more front layer. All right, we're gonna have to wait for those to despawn, unfortunately, which is gonna suck. Uh, I mean, this will be our little hut for now. I'll build a crafting station 
Or, yeah, I'll build a workbench in the front. But, okay. I'm liking it. I'm, 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 I'll grow on it. I think I'll grow on it. It's a good area for fishing, like I said. I'm really not too fond of this whole crafting thing, though. It's really hard. I, I, I'll get the hang of it. I'll get the hang of it. Anyway, this is our ours. I claim it. I claim it. And uh, now we're going to, what, build a workbench? We'll build a bed first, and then we'll build our own little workbench. All right. Where's the workbench at? The helmet. Leather crest. What is this? Area protection. Iron crest. Okay, so this, use a claim and conquer land. Only the owner and their guild members can place, pick up, build materials, including blocks in the area. Okay, so we definitely, we gotta make this. We gotta find leather hide and bone. Which I do get those from those animals, so those uh, the deer are definitely something I do have to kill so we can claim this and uh, not have any, anyone take our stuff. We get a chest. We're gonna get uh, a wooden. Uh, I mean, here's the structure right here. Here we go. What do we need? We need 450 wood. So unfortunately, we don't have that at the moment, but we can definitely just chop down some trees here. Place down our workbench. We'll chop down this tree here. You know, now that this is our area and we claim it, we'll be pretty set on it. Uh, I don't know how many I need. I think I need 200. This will be it, though. After I make this wood bench, or this work bench, I'm going to end the episode off because it's been pretty long for now. And we have food now, so I'm not going to worry too much about that dude taking uh, for my dude dying, though. Okay, we're out of water. Can I drink this? I guess should be able to. Did I just drop it? Oh my god, dude. I'm losing my mind here. Alright, I should be able to drink this. Drinking. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Alright, see, now, that definitely is water. It's gonna help. Hopefully, our body starts regenerating. See, now that we have that little pond here, I think it's a perfect area to start, to be honest. I'm gonna chop down this tree, build that workbench, though. And then end off the episode, like I said. Uh, probably get into more detail. I don't know if I'm gonna. If I'm gonna binge these out myself by making them first, or like what I'm gonna do there. Obviously, you guys don't really care because whenever you watch it, it, you're just watching it. So, we need how much more? We need 70 more. So, let's go chop down this big tree over here and uh, see how much wood we can get. We should get a lot from it, to be honest. Hopefully, it doesn't take too long. We do need 70 though. As soon, maybe as soon as we get 100. As soon as we get 100 from this tree, no matter if it's down or not, we will uh, we'll back out. We'll back out and uh, end up making that crafting table. Because, like I said, we're just trying to get this episode over. It's been pretty long. Uh, I prolonged the ending right now. All right, we got 100. Do we have 450? We do. So we can make that uh, We can make that workstation. Yeah. Oh, it's going to take a, take us about a minute. Another minute of constantly commentating and sucking ass right now because I'm not good at this. My voice is going to hurt from this. I don't talk in my videos, all right? It's so weird to do this. It's so weird to constantly talk. But I guess it's going to improve me as a person, improve my language, improve just, just I don't know, just talking in general. Maybe I'll be better at it. Because uh, I, I don't do this. Like I said, I don't, I don't talk in my videos. All I do is just talk to my friends, and I end up cutting out the funny moments. I've never done this kind of series. But hopefully, hopefully it does well. I start growing as a person, or uh, as a commentator at least, get better at it. Just start actually being entertaining, because I know it's, it's not fun to watch like Dead Space. Like, listening to someone and them just uh, not talking and being dead space and just background and them playing. It's just not fun and not amusing. And I know the constant, the consistency of someone talking just makes it that much better and that much entertaining. And that's what I want to throw at you guys. Hopefully you enjoy this, though. All right, so we got that workstation done. It seems to be getting nighttime. Uh, we'll definitely put that crafting station down. Then we got to go find leather. We got to go hunt some dude down and uh, or hunt that deer down. And uh, get some leather from that. Hopefully, do I have enough room for this? Can I not? I gotta move that chest, don't I? Do I gotta hold collect? Yeah. I gotta move you. So give me this. Give me this workstation. We're gonna put that in the corner like that. All right. Hopefully, we can angle this chest as well. No, that's a, that's a bed. All right. So we're we're probably gonna have to. We're definitely gonna have to make this bigger than it already is, as you can see, because. Uh, it doesn't fit everything, and we need that chest in there, so. Hopefully. Hopefully we can get the hang of this. 
All right, so it seems if I place on the slide on the side of something and then move it over, that's probably like the best way to do it because it realizes that you're trying to make it uh, next to the other one as long as you you know click the side and then move it forward. Uh, we seem pretty set on that. Maybe we can make one more one more side to this and we'll probably end it off. Like I said, I just want to make the workbench, but at the same time, I want to place everything down, put all of our stuff away just in case anything happens. We can work our way back here and uh, find where we left off. Hopefully we have enough blocks to finish this right now. Three, yeah, we have a per we made a perfect amount. Perfect amount of blocks here, boys. And hopefully we can uh, put this chest here and fill all of our items with it. Sick, that, this is perfect. This worked out so well. Uh, now let's just spam everything in there. And uh, so just this, this way if we die, like I'm not too worried about anything happening. What is this? Why is it not taking everything? There's no way it doesn't fit all of that here. Well, I don't want that in there. I'll take the bandages on me. The wood I would like. Clay I want in there. Uh, feathers in there. I'll keep some of this. Water, I'll keep that. I want the raw bird. The fat. Can I not? Okay. All right, we'll keep the fern on us. Keep the stone in there. We made two stiff beds. All right, so unfortunately, that that's going to suck. We're, we're going to have to upgrade this chest. I'm not quite sure how you do that or make a, a bigger chest at least. But anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you did, it's getting dark out right now. If you did, be sure to hit the like button below. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, yeah, peace out.